back to my channel. My name is Katie and today we have a new topic. We will be talking about what you are looking at on your screens right now. We are talking about Bitly. So I have a funny story to tell you before we start. Before, I didn't really know how to pronounce this. I didn't make any effort to research how you pronounce it, but just recently when I started teaching tutorials online, of course, I really, really need to know how it's pronounced so I don't make fun of myself. So yes, it's pronounced as bit.ly. Let's first understand why you need to use bit.ly. So what's the fuss all about? Why, why do you need to shorten your URL? So I have identified five reasons why you have to shorten your URLs. So the first reason is that you can you require lesser time to type, of course. So if you have a very long URL, you don't have time to memorize. So let me show you a long URL. So here you go. How would you be able to memorize that? And this is just one of the URLs out there. There are so many URLs in the world. So this is littlemisskesa.com forward slash 2015 forward slash 11 forward slash 5. Who has time for that, right? So what you need to do is just to copy that and paste that on your URL shortener website and you'll be good to go. And today we will be focusing on bit. I created an account in Bitly, I think in 2015 or 2016, if I'm not mistaken. But um, I checked on my account earlier just so I can tell you. I attached it to my Twitter account in 2016. So probably around that time. So what you need to do is to log in or to create an account by clicking on sign up. Because if you use this area right here in the middle you won't be able to track all the URLs that you created. So there would still be a chance that you will forget the short links that you have created because you won't have a way to track them. So it, it will be better for you to create an account so that you can check on the analytics anytime you want to check it. All right. So I already have an account. I don't click on sign up, but I'm clicking on login right now. Okay, so let's log in. Um, let's get to business. Um, this is my bit.ly interface or my workspace as you may call it. And I have created quite a few already if you take a look. And I honestly do not remember all the short URLs I have created already. And that's why it's really important for you to create your account so that you can go back or search. Um, if I search on, let's say, Creative Market right here, Bitly is going to show me all the links that I've created using or with Creative Market in the link. So it's going to show me this one. I have one for my affiliate account for the free goods and for the bundles. Um, I'm not sure if this is just all. Let me try to put a space and see. Yeah, I'm sure there are a lot of other creative market links that I've created in the past already. So if you are looking for previous accounts or previous links that you have created in the past, just play around with the keywords or make good use of the keywords and you'll be all set. So let me just review what are the advantages of creating shorter links. So again, you require lesser time to type. Second one would be lesser character consumption or usage. So if you are using Twitter because Twitter has a character limit, then you can save on the characters if you create um, simple and straightforward short URLs. And also it's easier to remember. Um, with all the URLs that we see every day, it's hard to remember everything. And of course, we don't have time for long URLs. And of course, consistency. If you are, if you have a YouTube channel, for example, then you can use Bitly to create a custom URL for all the links for each video. And also, of course, branding. So lately, 
um, what I'm trying my best to do is that I try to brand everything with Learn with Katie. All the links that I'm doing, I put Learn with Katie to it, but I think it's a little bit long. So I'm racking my brains right now on what um, what to use and it should be shorter than Learn with Katie. So if, if you are thinking of branding your links right now and not subscribing to the premium feature or to the corporate feature of bitly then you can use uh, your name but still use bit.ly all right so here's how you can do it we can take this for example just copy the link and then go to your bitly account click on create and then you have to paste the long url and then bitly will give you a link now you can customize it and you don't have to have a paid account to do this i am running on a free account and i'm very well capable of customizing my links but based on the definition of the custom url or custom bit link it's not necessarily customized you're just actually changing the url to make it easier to remember because um as per bitly definition i checked on the faq earlier custom bitly or branded bitly is actually when you change even bit.ly to say es.pn for espn or maybe if i am that maybe lmk.com or something so um just for the sake of simplicity let's just refer to this as custom url because technically you are customizing it anyway so the topic is five fonts to love and add to your collection so what i'm gonna do is to actually put learn with kdm sorry the letter e on my keyboard is duplicating again so let me just quickly change that learn with kt five fonts now be careful in adding or in editing or customizing your links because you only have one chance to do that you can edit it in the future but you cannot use the old name again so the, the there's only one chance for you to use the extension or the link here that you have created so say for example i use learn with katie underscore five fonts and i cannot use that again if in case i want to edit this in the future so this will be redirecting to the old url that we have created okay now what you can do to use it is just to copy it here or to copy it here and or just click share and you can share it now we just copied and you see let's see what it shows using the long url and let's open it using the short url so it go it went or it redirected to the same website that we are looking at earlier so here you go now what other things that you need to consider yeah um let's look at the analytics so it will show you right here i have created 398 bit links already so far and it's it will show you clicks all time for example the powtoon underscore adobe ps link that i created before this is for powtoon's webinar it was clicked 77 times so let me click on that and we can see the analytics in here referrers were facebook 66 people clicked from facebook and 11 people clicked from email sms or direct links and most of the people who clicked are from the philippines and then next would be other countries, Netherlands, United States, and four others. So that's how you check the analytics. So there, if you have any questions about how to use Bitly or you're just curious why I love using it, let me know. Leave a comment on the comments box below. If you are using a different custom URL creator, then let me know, share with me, and probably you can try it out as well. And maybe one day I can create a 
comparison videos. So there, this will just be quick. I just showed you how to use Bitly and how to create custom link. And if you haven't tried using it, go ahead, try it out. It's easy. It doesn't take rocket science to understand how it works. I highly recommend it. It's one of the tools that I really love using and I've saved it on my bookmark so I can use it anytime. Try and use Bitly and let me know how your experience is. I would love to know and I will be recording more videos in the future. So if you have any requests on what topic you would want me to talk about, let me know and I'll do my best to record the video as per your request. Thank you so much again for visiting my channel and if this is your first time and you haven't subscribed yet, I hope you click on the subscribe button and click on the bell as well so that you will be notified when I publish a new video. Alright, thank you so much again and you have a great day or night wherever you are in the world. Bye bye! Before you came round, my heart would never be much faster. Before you came round, I was ready to stop.